but South Park is, you know, and the chapter kind of ends with like they're champions of free speech and offending people and investigating, um, you know, free speech and freedom of expression. And that's very important in, in, in the show to kind of like, you know, delve into open societies. And South Park in many ways represents an, an open society because, um, you know, and reflects the views of that because they are going after extreme, extreme, after extremists, you know, on the left and on the right. All right, so we're going to watch about last night. Again, this is another parody on the 2008 election between John McCain um, and Barack Obama. <clears throat> and um, again, it's, it's another satirical rip on dual party extremism where we have, um, you know, the Obama supporters who change, change and getting drunk in, in, the, in the city. And then you have the McCain supporters who fucking, you know, basically make an arc and, uh, you know, uh, want, you know, think they're going to die and, and all this stuff. So it's a sort of a joke about how people feel at, at that time, um, specifically on the, on the left and right. Um, and, you know, um, I mean, you really see it in the, in, when they bring him to the hospital and they ask, you know, is he a McCain supporter or, you know, um, or a, a Obama supporter? And that will deal with how they're going to they're going to treat them, you know. So just kind of pay attention to that, how they South Park again goes into the you know, extreme uh, left and right um, views here and the celebration like. When Randy yells, loser, you know, and taunts them, I mean, um, that's pretty interesting because, you know, who wins and who loses in that? Um, yeah, your candidate gets elected into office, but who wins and who loses? Just like, uh, you know, a lot of people, uh, you know, who support Trump, you know, talk about people who are like not into Trumpito and say, oh, you're just mad you lost. Like, this ain't a fucking basketball game. You know, it's, it's very different, you know. So I think that's something to um, kind of chew on. Um, but we have a parody, too, of obviously the Oceans trilogies, right, where there's a whole heist. That's the, that's the other part of the narrative. South Park, well, as you know, usually has, like, two storylines that kind of come, come together uh, at, at the end in some way with, with the moral. Um, but, again, it's just, you know, another way of satirizing uh, dual-party extremism. So... Um, press play on this uh just think about how you know they kind of get into some of these ideas and extremism in general and think about um how some of the same stuff came through uh in uh douche vs turd <laughs> 